All right, guys, as promised, I am back on the strip in Belden Village in Canton, Ohio. We are going to go back into this Halloween city here that used to be a Babies R Us. And we are going to see if the animatronics are set up because I am dying to see what some of these do. Yes, it looks like they're all set up. Thank God. Let's go check these things out. This lady's stomping on a thing over here. <laughs> okay, wait, there's people looking at them all, so let's look at these first. Here's this one. I don't know why they have it turned backwards. Um, these, I think, just light up. I'm not exactly sure if they do anything or not. Terror Twins. I think they have that one set up over there. Lonely Laura. Leg kicking, head turning. Okay, that sounds cool. Creeper from the grave. Behind the grave awaits a terrible surprise. I'm assuming it's just that arm that pops out, but I guess we'll find out. Hopefully they have that one set up. Okay, here they are. Let's go start with the nun. That's the one I left off with last week. Look at the face on this thing. That is already creepy enough. <laughs> that scares the crap out of me, man. Look at that thing. Oh my god. Okay, I'm almost afraid, but here we go. Oh, come on. Please tell me this thing works. Oh, here we go. Okay, I don't get it. When I st I have to keep my foot on it. <laughs> I mean, that's creepy enough. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed though. She's scary, but I was really hoping she was gonna like lunge at me and scare the crap out of me. Hey, wait, we got a couple of them here. This is the one that I said the other day. Uh, I think it just sits up, and I said the other day that it was, it reminded me of Michael Myers when he sits up, so let's see. Ooh, here he comes. Well, that mu that's not much of a sit up, but okay. I would assume... There we go. He's probably supposed to come all the way up like that. We'll try this again. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, yeah, I see what the problem is. This is not like weighted down. I ain't even touching that. Forget this. <laughs> okay. So this part here, you see how it's going down now? It's actually supposed to be weighted down so that when you activate it, he will actually sit all the way up. But I don't know, for some reason that's not doing what it's supposed to. Oh, here's the toys. Hold on, we'll do this. This is the forgotten toys. We saw this in the party city the other day. Let me see if I can get this going. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I love the teddy bear, how he's stitched up and he's missing an eye. <laughs> okay, here's these ones that I think are supposed to glow. Okay, I'm so disappointed so far in these things. You can kind of see a little bit of light going on in there. They're making a little bit of noise, but they don't move at all. $100, I don't think so. Okay, then we got the attack spider here. I think that's this one here. Ooh! Dang, he jumped out fast too, but it doesn't do any good when he jumps to the side. There we go, I repositioned him. Watch how fast he shoots out. <laughs> Oh my god! That's, I don't know if that's like controlled by air or what, but he jumped out fast. Okay, we got the rattling grave buster here, which we saw the other day in Party City. Okay, that's not too bad. What in the world is going on here? It looks like the girls 
somebody ripped the cord out so I don't think we're gonna get to see them work obviously it's not wireless so that sucks but whoa here we go I guess it's set up for uh, what do you call it motion activation all right What in the world is going on with these things? This is a travesty. <laughs> it's our jumping spider, and it needs to be set up where it's turned towards the step pad. Okay? That's how it, what makes it effective, Halloween City. There you go. That's the way it works, right there. Listen to him. The sound is definitely creepy. Okay, so we got the Lady in Grey and Lonely Laura here. <laughs> Nothing from the Lady in Grey. Lonely Laura. <laughs> she said, I live here in the graveyard. Would you like to live here with me? Look at her feet going. That was kind of creepy. All right. Here's a good looking one. This is Slender Man. Although they call it Animated Tall Slim Man with creepy audio. So let's check him out. Ooh, you got to get close to this one. crying she just got scared by the sewer grabber that thing even scares the crap out of me okay let's do the sewer grabber and show you exactly what just scared that girl if we can get here we go that little girl was sitting right down here watching this <laughs> scared the living crap out of her she went nuts Okay, here's the life-size, uh, whatever you call them, Pennywise here. Oh, clap to activate. There he goes. He makes some noise and just goes back and forth. And unfortunately, they don't have these set up. They don't. I don't see one of these roaming around anywhere. And I have yet to been to be anywhere that has had this one going. But I would love to see what it does. I think it just simply pops out real fast. I don't know why they aren't setting him up though. Okay, guys. So if I had to grade all of these, I would say the sewer grabber is my favorite, and that's an A plus. He's awesome. Well, maybe not an A+, because you can't understand a word that he's saying. But he is scary, he looks good, and he always works perfect. This one up here, I mean, he's cool. He would be a cool uh, animatronic just to have, you know, floating in your yard, I guess. But that's all he does. Slender Man, he's okay. I would have to say I'd give him about a C. This girl, the lonely Laura, eh, I'd give her about a C, too. She doesn't, like, jump out and scare you, but she is creepy. Animated lady in gray, I don't know. I don't know what she's supposed to do, but she didn't do anything here, so I'm going to have to give her a C, just because she looks good, but she doesn't do anything right at the moment, so I can't really give it a good grade. This one, I give an F. <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, look at the faces. They look cool. And when they light up, it looks cool. And you can see what they're supposed to do. But, I mean, this is their ad right here. If I was thinking of buying this and I saw this hanging there, I'd not be buying it. I'm sorry, guys. Especially not for $200.
This one is one of my favorites. He always works great. See him again. See, he's awesome. I give that one an A. I love that one, and for 50 bucks, that's an awesome price. These animated things here, I give an F. They don't do anything. You can hardly see the lights. You can't hear anything that's going on, but you can tell there's something going on. This black attack spider, he's awesome. He shoots out so fast and immediately when you step on the pad. So I give him an A too. For 50 bucks, that's a good price. Animated, rattling, grave buster. I don't know. It's not too shabby, but he just doesn't do enough for me. Um, let's see. Forgotten toys. I love the way they look. But they move too slow for me. I'd have to say I'd give them a, a B just because they look really good. And this guy here. If you could weight that part down where he would sit up the way he's supposed to, I'd probably give that a B plus. Because he is pretty awesome and he does remind me of Michael Myers sitting up straight, so... The Nun. <laughs> I'd have to give her a B plus also. Because that is creepy looking right there. Probably my favorite one in here. Well, aside from the sewer grabber. But I do wish that she, like, was a jump scare. Come on. Yep. Because she's definitely creepy and scary. But I wish she jumped at you. Alright, let's go over here see if there's any other ones that are just sitting out that we haven't seen. I don't see any. I think we covered everything. Yeah, there's a couple over here, but we looked at these the other day. There's John Doe. That's the one that sets up. And here's the dog that apparently jumps out and scares you, but I'm not sure. I did notice in my last video this try me button that I didn't see before. Nothing. No button. Okay, her eyes are lighting up. Okay. And of course we got all the inflatables here that we looked at in the last video. I won't go over those again. Uh, this might be one that wasn't set out when we were here. Zero coming out of the doghouse. That's a pretty cool one. And this was not set up. Here's a try me. You can't really hear it inside the box there, but you can see the eyes light up. And the ghost swing. So, I think that's it. This is a pretty cool store. Pretty cool animatronics. Um, they just need to make sure that they work when people are looking at them. So, 